Roxham Town Centre stretch, well known for the amount of fish that come out. And today we've already seen a bit of action. Randolph is on the float and he has had a pike come up and tried to take his roach. So I'm going to bung the pike rod out in just a few minutes and see whether I can have anything. I'm also going to have my feeder out as well. Let's get fishing and see what comes along. Your float's gone, mate. All right, they've got one. Oh yeah. That's a good one as well, I think. This might be my first double. Cool. That's a double, Bloody Charles. Hell. That is, look at the size of its back. Nice and gentle. Oh yes, happy days. Right, it's in the net, let's deal with it. We're just gonna give her a quick weigh and then we'll, then we'll take some photos and then we'll pop her back. We've I haven't had breakfast yet. <laughs> We've given her a rest. Now, I've never caught a double figure pike before. And this, well, I would have thought. Well, this is your new PB. I'm putting it around 14, 15. Scales work, that's good. <laughs> Just over 15. God, keep still. 15 on the nose, my man. I don't know if the camera will pick the numbers up. Yep. Well, that's all right for your first uh, pike, isn't it? 15. First, first double, yeah. 15 pound Norfolk Broads Pike. Yeah, happy days. Very happy with that. Let's go ahead and slip it back. What a beauty. You looked out of that fish well, Charlie. Right, so we've actually moved from the centre of Roxham and we're now in Richardson Boatyard. Now this place is not always going to be available to fish. Um, they are going to stop the fishing soon. So, you know, I wouldn't hassle them. But I'm having my first ever go on a whip. I've never used a whip before. And I know it's quite effective when going after roach and rod. So we're just going to have to see what happens. I love the presentation and it's so easy to use. Got to be careful of the water on the camera. There you go. What's it like? Oh cool, yeah, bloody <laughs> hell. What? Cool, that's like bloody fighting a... Oh, cool, that's a big one. You use your net then? Oh, that's big. Don't lose it. That's a rub. That's a nice fish. On the whip. First fish on the whip. Cool, look at that. Good hell. That's a PB rod. God, first fish on the whip. And that's a big old rod. Happy days. Oh my gosh. <laughs> cool, I'm a lucky man today. Yeah, you're that way, that. Lovely rod. Beautiful. First fish on the whip. Let's get back out there. That's oh. a lovely rod, isn't wow, it? Wow, that was amazing on this whip. He's in again. Look at that whip. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, lovely. Look at that. <sighs> Not as big as you thought, I bet. No. But the whip's good, isn't it? The action on it is brilliant. Yeah, it's excellent. Another nice perch. God, coming hell. in on half a worm. That thing's got to be at least a pound. I reckon pound and a half, that is. Well, have a look. Is that my car I just whacked? Yeah. Hold on, I'll hold it up for you. Lovely, nice one. Yeah, let's see if we can get some more of them. Is that on sweet corn? No, worm. On worm, that was. Nice one. <laughs> that was on a big old bit of sweet corn, that one. This was Randolph's net of fish. 
nice little bag there. Now unfortunately I couldn't use the audio here because it was uh, raining so I couldn't actually use the microphones. There's my nice rud and bag of fish. Look at all those, a mixed bag there, perch, rud, roach. Decided to weigh the rud. Here's a picture of the weight. And off goes the fish. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Check out these videos, which are now on the screen right now.